Hey everybody, DeLong Shot Signatures here. This is episode 70 of my 2024 TTM returns. We just have two successes uh, to start off this week. First one is actually from Saturday. This is a hero card return. Uh, given all of the changes that this team has got undergone this year so far, it makes sense to only get two, but it's two good ones. Uh, this is two signed hero cards received in 89 days from IndyCar team. Arrow McLaren got back an Alexander Rossi and a Pato Award hero card. I think I already got a Pato one signed um, at the full field signing and then uh, wasn't able to get Rossi on his hero card, so to be able to get it this way is really nice. Um, they're typically a three card team. They did have David Malukas signed on early in the year. He was, of course, let go after his wrist injury uh, partway through the season. They've had Callum Eilat, uh, Teo Porcher, and then they dropped Teo Porcher out of nowhere to sign on Nolan Siegel, who it looks like will take on the seat for the rest of the year. They did have a fourth entry, uh, only for the 500 with Kyle Larson. I was able to get one of those signed, so um, I think the only two... I think I got Callum Eilat at the... Uh, full field session, so I think the only one I would be missing would be Teo Porcher if they ended up uh, making a hero card for him. But uh, pretty cool to get that. The other one is a baseball return. Um, been meaning to get this one for a while, but I was missing a card, so I ordered that one off of COMC. Got it back uh, two of two in 14 days. A little bit disappointing because this was a $10 fee per. This is former MLB player Kurt Ford. Not the greatest signature there. Um, not a super big name player by any means. I think he played for five seasons. Uh, fourth round pick. You know, you know, did play in the MLB. And then also managed um, later on. Uh, don't know exactly at what levels, but I think he was a manager slash head coach for a wood bat uh, collegiate team. Um, Beyond that, not too much else that I can say, uh, other than it's some set editions. It just kind of stinks to pay 10 bucks and, you know, not much of an autograph, but hey, it is what it is. Those are done for the set, and I don't have to bother him anymore. But that is it for this one. Thank you guys for watching. I really appreciate it. It helps me out a lot. Best luck with your guys' collecting. Take care.